Once again, welcome to our Copy Pro Traders Saturday Affiliate Training. We're streaming live on Facebook as well. My name is Demetrius Coach D. Etheridge, and I'm one of your affiliates here. I'm just going to share some information with you today, and then we have an awesome training set up for those that are here and those that are going to watch the recording. So if your teammates are saying, hey, I can't get in, I can't get in, tell them relax. We're going to get this to them right on the Telegram room right on Facebook. If you got groups, you can post a link and share it from my page. I already put it in the, uh, I put it in the chat. So we're going to get started because we want to make sure we get this information into people's hands as fast as possible. A lot of people are on this call and they're excited. I've been on doing this since January the 1st when we first started. And I'm telling you, I am fired up. We got people all over the world, literally joining copy pro traders and this is the reason why let me share the quick two minute video that was released yesterday and we're going to roll right onto our training are you a professional cryptocurrency trader no we have a simple process for you to follow where you make the exact same trades as the pros automatically. When they make a trade, you make the same trade at the same time. If you're a professional trader, reach out to us. We have followers wanting to follow your trades. Here's how our system works. Our subscribers get on a crypto exchange and provide an API key which allows the system to make trades for them while always maintaining 100% possession of their crypto. When a pro trader makes a trade, their followers make the same trade automatically. So all of the pro's knowledge and experience is effortlessly passed on to you. What about those promise to pay programs that offer guaranteed returns? Well, they always crash and burn, leaving their regular Joes with absolutely nothing. How many times do you wanna go through that? There's a stronger, smarter, and better way to do things. Why would you ever give up control of your crypto if you can have the advantage of professional trading skills working for you 24 7. Cryptocurrency is real, it's spendable, it's global, and it's a viable way to move beyond just exchanging your time for money. Crypto is in the mass adoption stage and it's becoming mainstream. The headlines are changing and now is the time to take advantage of it. We welcome you to our simple and effective system. You're at exactly the right place at the right time. Don't let this opportunity pass you by, especially when it's this easy. When you make a difference in your world, you can make a positive difference in the world. In spirit of community and sharing, a portion of your proceeds will go to Missions of Love, which helps people in need around the world battling malnutrition, mental health issues, and natural disasters. We want you to be so happy with our service that you tell others about us. We also have a rewarding affiliate program automatically make the same trades as pros, optionally make referrals for affiliate rewards, and help us help those that need it. Start copying pro traders today. Welcome everyone. So yes, we have, I'm already seeing uh, that we're locked out. People are getting locked out. I thought I had it set for 200, but it's not. It's still set at 100. So we're going to uh, get some pro traders on. So ladies and gentlemen, so we're going to ask that some of the people, the the distributors that is already active, you know this system, when we get ready, we're going to ask you to go off and let some of the pro traders come on. I promise you, we're going to get this to you. If you're watching this on Facebook, go ahead and log out and continue to watch it on Facebook so we can get some of the other people on. That way... Uh, we'll want to make sure everybody's there. I thought the account was set up for hire, but it evidently didn't kick in. So you're not going to miss anything. I promise you that. You're going to get this information, especially if you're already on Facebook. You can all see it. Um, so the best affiliate marketing training out there. I truly believe as we continue to grow that we're going to uh, – you're going to see some of the best affiliate marketing training in here, not only from Copy Pro Traders, but from people that are joining the community. We have some powerful leaders that are coming in and they are from this affiliate marketing space. 
and they're going to be bringing systems. They're going to be bringing different things to this uh, platform. And I truly believe that you're going to see the best affiliate marketing training coming out of Copy Pro Traders in the future. Remember, ladies and gentlemen, it's about how you start. Let me say that again. It's about how you start. See, if anybody here ever ran track, you know, coming out the blocks is the most important thing in a track, especially in the sprints. Because if you come out the block wrong, if you stayed down too long, if you, didn't, if you bring your head up too fast, you lost the race. So in Copy Pro Traders, a lot of people come out the block in different ways. They come out in different ways, but we want to show you how to come out the blocks the right way with Copy Pro Traders. Because in Copy Pro Traders, there's two ways to come out the block. There's two ways to come out the block. There's a sprinter's race. And that's for those that want the affiliate commissions that's going to share this with people. That's the sprinters race. We all come out the block fast. We're trying to get our links out and, you know, we're trying to get this information out so we can start earning affiliate commissions. But if you know this system and once you get an understanding, it's the marathon from the exchange profits to where you're going to benefit the most. That's where you're going to have the most success understanding how the system works. So there's the sprinter side which a lot of people on here love to sprint, but that marathon race over there that comes from the exchange profits, ladies and gentlemen, we're all in the same pool. We're all racing the same, but it's about how much we are trading that determines our profit. That's going to be the key. How much we're trading is going to be determined our profit. So I'm going to ask again, ladies and gentlemen, I know you guys don't want to get off, but for my people that, that are on Facebook and you're sharing this, Log out so we can get the pro traders on. All the pro traders cannot get on right now. So if you're sharing this on Facebook, go ahead and log out. You're not going to miss anything. We're also going to send the uh, the recording going to be a place inside of our Copy Pro Traders Telegram group and on the Facebook page as soon as we get done. So we can you just can I jump in there quickly? People yeah. are struggling to get on your Facebook page, and I know the value that we're going to get from this. So can we try and solve that somehow? Can you resend me your link, please? Because the, the other one's asking us to log in. How do we get on your actual page? Well, Wes, let me tell you this. They're not my friend. They're not going to see it anyway. Just tell them they're going to get the recording. Let's let's not stop what we're doing. They're going to get the recording. Okay, cool, 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 cool. So we're going to do that. So I need people to understand this. You're not going to get the traders unless some people get off. The traders are trying to get on. And, you know, hey, it's just one of those things. We're growing. I thought I had it set for more. Evidently, um, Zoom didn't uh, upgrade the account, but I did it last week. So we're going to get some of the traders on. Let's get the traders on right quick. So for those individuals that are already here, we want to let some of the traders get on. And let me see. Let me see. It's Ramon because he dropped off. He's trying to get back on. I'm in, Coach. I'm in, Coach. Okay, Ramon is in. Coach, Coach Joe, Mar Joe Marshall, you here? Yes, sir. All right. Carlos, you here? I don't know if Carlos, I know he's working sometimes, so he might not be able to on. But okay, but we'll do that. But we got three. I know uh, Doha is here as well. So that's good. So we're going to continue. Thank you, guys. Oh, man, y'all make Coach feel good, man. Don't make me feel like a praise over here. So let's keep going. What I want to do now, since I just talked about this race, you know, we got a lot of sprinters on our team in our community. They're getting this information out there, and it's growing rapidly. But that marathon, this is what Mr. McBay want us to really understand, the marathon. And the traders are going to talk about the marathon of trading. It's not a sprint. It is a marathon. And you got to understand the marathon in order to do it. So I'm going to give a scenario real quick. I love this scenario because I give it all the time on my training. This is one of the trades that happened in January when we first started. In this scenario, I want you, if you can grasp this concept, and I know you're going to understand, this gave me a real true aha moment. And I know Joe, uh, Marshall, Ramon, and Doha is going to talk about this in the different strategies. But think about this. Look at the top, 36.51% minus 3.16% equals 33.35%. Ladies and gentlemen, we got this in one day. One day. And it's an anomaly, yes. It, but can it happen again? Yes. But if you're not properly structured in your account, you're going to miss this. Now, that probably structure. For this scenario, I want you to say you got $1,000 in your account. And I'm going to walk you through this. Catch this for me. 
catch this. That number one, you see the one, the buy market, that link trade was from the previous day. So on the 23rd, when it came over, it sold for 2.39%. If you look all the way to the right, that's 2.39%. It was a trade from the previous day that the trader held. It came over and sold. Now, you look at two, three, and, four, and six. This is the key strategy. The trader went in and bought Ethereum at 13.25 on that day. What is our strategy? The buy low, sell high. That's what we want to do all the time. Hey, in a perfect world, we'll do that. And if it was perfect, none of us would be on this call. Because <laughs> we could go buy low and sell high on our own. But <laughs> it didn't work. The market dropped. So instead of panicking, the traders can say, hey, we're going to take that trade and we're going to hold it. Now, you had $100 in your account. It took $100 from your exchange and put it into the market. So your tether went from 100 to 900. 1,000 to 900, excuse me. So you got $100 in the trade. Guess what the market did? It dropped again. The, on number three, the trader bought that again at 1258. So another $100 came out of your tether account and went into a trade. So now your tether is at $800 because $200 is in trade. We're not panicking here because we know the market can correct itself within seconds, minutes, hours, days, even weeks. We just hold the trade until the market corrects itself. That's all we're doing. So while this is going on, the trader makes another trade at number four with Litecoin. That trade wind up being a loss for 3.16%, but it's a $100 trade. So your account went from 800 now to 700. But now when that trade lost, they minus 3.16% from that hundred that you was in the trade, not from your entire account, just from the amount that was in that trade. Get that. So a lot of people think that they count. So you only lost 3.1% of that hundred dollars that was in that trade. Then number five, there was another hundred dollars went into a trade for Litecoin, but that time it was a win for 9.23%. So they added the hundred back plus the 9.23% minus the exchange fees. All right. So lastly, we still in two trades, number two and number three with our uh, Ethereum. It kept dropping on this day. Finally, the trader bought it again at 1,091. Another hundred dollars came out of your account. Well, not out of your account. It just went from your account into a trade. Your money never leaves your account. Let me, I have to make sure I say that right. Cause some people, it never gets taken out of your exchange account. It just goes from that account, the tether, into a trade. And you can track all this on your exchange. Now, look at number six. Later on that day, that trade, the 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 uh the market shift, Ethereum went back up. The trader made a sale at a thousand one thousand three hundred nine dollars. That one trade made nineteen point nine two percent. So if you had $100, you got your money back plus 19.92% minus the fees. What if you had 1,000 of a trade? What if you had 2,000 of a trade? It's on you, ladies, and what you're trading. We want to show you how to maximize the system. But look up. Go back up to number three. That trade that we bought at 12.58 sold for 13.10 for 4.08. So that $100 that was in that trade, you just made some more money minus the exchange fees. Then the first trade, it minimized the loss and it wound up being a win for 0.89. So at the end of the day, you add up all six of those trades for a total of 36.51% minus 3.16 for the loss for 33.35. Now, were we happy? Were we, everybody was, yes, we were. If you was in on all those trades, and we know a lot of people don't have their account set up right, so they're not in on all the trades. But we understand that. That's why we do these trainings. That's why we say get plugged in. That's why the traders are going to come on today and give you some more insight that Coach D can't give you. I'm just like, hey, I just got up under the spout where the information came out, and I started sharing this to everybody. I am raising a flag, and I want to tell people this is the system that you want to get in. So now let me show you some updates real quick and I'm gonna get out the way.
when you log in now and you somebody registers, leaders, please hear me when I say this over these next few slides. Do not leave people out there by themselves. Now, I know some people are finding our links out there and they're just going in to sign up. And those that are very savvy that understands crypto, blockchain, and wallets, they're signing up without even talking to nobody. I'm sending people emails trying to welcome. They say, oh, they're not even responding. So I leave them alone. But for those that don't, the novice that signs up, they don't know what to do. So when you're signing up, this is what's going to happen after you register, make your username, put your email address in. Now you got to pay for your $99 subscription. Now, sometimes depending on what you're looking at, you might not see the BTC address that you can, uh, that you have to send the address to. So, so I tell people, log out and log back in and you'll see it. But in a perfect world, you're going to see, this is how it's going to line up. You're going to see that QR code that if you got your phone, you could go to your wallet or your exchange and you can open up the scan and scan that code and it'll automatically put the amount over into your from your exchange to send but one thing we are noticing depending on the exchange or the wallet that you're using you see that btc amount with the red arrow right there the exchanges and wallet are subtracting their fee from that that 99 dollars is what's supposed to go to copy pro traders to activate your platform so what is happening is the exchange is taking their fee out of that and is making your deposit come up short and your now your account is in limbo. So ladies and gentlemen, we want to make sure that when you go over to your exchange, you see that address, you want to make sure that the right amount is there. So you can go on Explore or any one of the blockchains well, and you can track this. Now this might be well over some people's heads on here, but that's all right. We got to get you up to speed on this over time. But for the leaders on here, show your people how to go to the blockchain explorer and track their, their uh, fees going across and to, so their account can get activated. Also, you must remember this right here, the cent. You want to make sure that that cent amount in BTC is the same right here that you're sending, that Copy Pro Traders ask you to send. If it's anything less, your account is going to be in limbo because there's not enough funds to activate your account. I hope everybody caught that one because that's the key. We're getting a lot of things on that. And that's not Copy Pro Traders. That's the exchange. So make sure your exchange is not subtracting their fee out of the $99 amount you're supposed to send. You can adjust that. And if you need help, reach out and we'll make sure you understand. Another feature that Copy Pro Traders did after you make after you made your transaction look after making your payment click here to check your status you're going to be able to check to make sure your exchange is connected with our copy pro traders platform now so you'll be able to check that you'll be able to check your status and make sure after you set up everything with copy pro traders so that coach it. let me just interject real quick coach yeah. that is the uh the to verify the payment My fault. so yeah. that they yeah. can see that the payment has gone through and basically it kind of goes back to those slides. So if they're short, they'll be able to see it on the blockchain. So that link takes them straight to the blockchain where they can see the status of their transaction of the payment. Sorry about that. No, thank you. That Hey, see coach, I always make mistakes, but I'm, I'm all humble enough to be corrected. Even live. <laughs> Let's keep going. Hey, so we get into the back office of that. This everybody, if you're here now, if you're a guest or someone invited you here, this is mainly for affiliates, but we know guests are on. Once you get in your dashboard, you're going to click dashboard. You're going to click. It's going to be a drop down menu to all the different places you can go. Right here is going to be exchange settings. OK. You want to go ahead and you're going to hit exchange settings. And this page is going to pop up right here at the top. It said trading funds must be available in Tether. Oh, Mr. McBay, I want to remind you, people say, please put that in red for the novice. They don't know what Tether is. They can't see that. So they want that in red for you, sir, if you can. To begin trading, all the trading got to be in USDT. That is our tether coin. And I know a lot of you, uh, a lot of people out here who says, I want Bitcoin. You can still get Bitcoin, but we want to accumulate our funds in tether. And you can go buy as much as you want once you get that. But we're doing that for a reason. So we go in the market low, buy high. We get out, we sell high, guess what happens? We don't want to lose that game we just got. So if Bitcoin dips, we want to go back into Tether and keep the game. 
because the traders are like, oh, it dipped. I'm going to go back in today, later on the day, buy again, ride it back up. Imagine making money on the same amount of volume over and over and over as the currency goes up and down. That's why we're doing it. And we are going to get some big uh, BTC pairs. We just ask you to have patience and let the system grow. Grow with us. How, that's a great thing. Grow with Copy Pro Traders because it's 70 days old and running. And believe me, we're running fast. Remember the sprint? Mr. McBay, I don't know when he sleeps. I have no idea when he sleeps. But I know every time I get on WhatsApp to talk to him, he's up. So think about that. We got a chairman that really cares about what's going on. So once you get back here, ladies and gentlemen, you're going to see our three exchanges that we're on. There's been an update. We're on Kraken, Binance.com, and hit BTC. KuCoin is no longer on the platform. And that's going to change over time. You're going to get more exchanges as we continue to build this out. Right now, I can tell you we're in the process of uh, doing Coinbase Pro and Gemini. So bear with us as we grow. And you're going to continue to see this platform evolve. Imagine being able to say, I was back there when it was only three exchanges, four exchanges. I was back there before we got emails telling us the different things. That's going to be the power of what you see right here. So now, once you get into the platform and you select your uh, default exchange, I want you guys to see this. Look, on the, each exchange, there are some instructions. These are clickable tabs right here. They're going to open up to a PDF, and you'll be able to walk you through to show you how to set up your API keys and get them over to Copy Pro Traders. So remember, you pay your $99 in Bitcoin. You go get your exchange because the exchange is free. You put KYC, know your client, know your customer on the exchange, so you can deposit your funds inside the exchange. Convert them to USDT so you can start trading with Copy Pro Trader. You're going to take those two lines of code that we call API keys. And there's a secret key right here. It could be called private key on the exchange as well. You're going to bring them over here. You're going to save them on your exchange. You're going to put your default exchange. You're going to save it over here as well. Also, ladies and gentlemen, you're going to pick your trader. See the traders right here, you're gonna be able to select the trader. If you're on and someone invited you, ask them the trader they're following and ask them why. Why are they following? They, they should have a reason why they're following the trader. But the traders on the day, and they're gonna give you some more insight uh, on their strategies and some other things. I don't know what they're gonna say, but that's why you're here today. So select your trader, select your amount right here that you wanna trade. Now the $30, uh, the minimum right here, Mr. McBay has put this in here so that you can test it out to make sure you're connected. But don't let your minimums be your maximums over here because we all know when you start getting this percentage, it's based on the amount you're trading. So if there's a trade and there's a 2.5% win, you're getting 2.5% of $30 that you're trading USDT. Somebody else might be getting 100, 500, 1,000, 6,000. Whatever that whatever they're trading, that's what you're getting a percentage of of this amount that you're putting right here. Also, make sure you click the box, activate trading. See, ladies and gentlemen, over here, we're not copying them. <laughs> we are, but we're not. We're clicking a box, and the system does the work once we set up the API key. So even though we call it copy pro traders, we're really checking the box. And then that's what's happening. So that's us, some of the new updates. The, the website is going to be updated as well in the near in the, in the next week or so. So just bear with us as we continue to grow. But this is what I want you to do from Coach today. I want you to understand the importance of plugging into a success system. We have a success system here. We got our official Telegram group. We got our Copy Pro Traders webinars and training that goes out on the group. We're getting ready to do a Facebook group. Leaders are starting their own groups. And you're going to see the system grow and grow and grow over time. Like I say, be here a year from now. We will say in 30 days, 90 days, no. Be here a year from now and be able to tell your story on how you got involved with Copy Pro Traders. So, guys, ladies and gentlemen, I want to thank you guys for this little allowing me to share with you right here. Now I'm going to get out the way. I'm going to bring out the chairman, Mr. Anton McBay, and he's going he's to lead us down the road to success talking with our Copy Pro Traders. Mr. McBay, you there, sir? I am. I am. 
Excellent. Thank you so very much, Coach. I really appreciate your leadership, man. You bring so much value to CPT. There's so many other leaders that are here plugging in. They want to make sure they get the information so they can lead their teams. So I greatly, greatly appreciate it. Guys, it is very, very exciting times right now. I mean, there's a lot of growing pains, obviously, but that's good. That's to be expected with any company. And the one thing that I can say is that we are going to get better and better and better. For those of you that started with us in January, you remember when we started trade and there were no emails letting you even know that we were in trades. Now you get emails letting you know when we're in, letting you know when we're out, where you can go verify that information on your exchange. So also now what we've done is we've made it easy in the back office now to make sure you know how to properly set up your account for funding for trading. So we added there where you can now trade up to 15% of your actual account balance. That's kind of going to be the recommended number up to 15%. If you want to do more than that, now that's you, but we're giving you our recommendation up to 15%. Okay. So, and you want to make sure you can be in multiple trades. These traders are going to talk a little bit about that in terms of maybe how many trades you need to make sure that you can position yourself to be in. They're going to talk about maybe frequencies of trade and, 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 how often they trade, what days they trade, what trade days they don't trade, which to be honest with, I think they're looking to trade every single day, but obviously the market depends on that, but you're going to hear from them. Uh, the reason we're doing this is because we want you to know that they're real. They're real people. Uh, <laughs> they're not hired by the company. To be quite honest with you, these traders don't have to be here. I think it's so important for you to understand they don't have to be here. They can do what they're doing without CPT. It just so happened that they believe in the cause, they believe in serving, and they love the functionality of the software, and they understand the ability to be able to scale on a global level leveraging this software. And for you and everyday ordinary people to be able to follow and take the exact same trades is a big, big deal. Our business model is not on trial. I need you to understand that it is not on trial. It is working. And when there are little glitches and hiccups, I can pretty much tell you 99% of the time, it's not on CPT. It's either with the exchanges or something like that. Because remember, we're talking about software. We're talking about connection of API keys. Kraken had a little issue again today. There was a notice. I was about to send that notice out to the Telegram channel. But guess what? Kraken got it together right quick. Binance has issues from time to time. And it's not just those companies, those exchanges. Almost every exchange will have some kind of API issue from time to time. And so what we're going to do is we can get better when those things happen. We can put a test button in the back office so that you can test to make sure that the API keys are working. It's not there today, but it's coming. Trust me, we're working on it. It is coming so that when you sign up someone new, then they pay, paste in their API keys. They hit that test button. They can test the trade to make sure they are set up properly. It will let them know if something is wrong and it will tell them exactly what is wrong. One of the other things that uh, I see happening in which coach addressed this, and, and that's another reason why we put the hyperlink there below the QR codes so that you can track your payment. People that are making their payments, sending the BTC from an exchange, from an exchange, the exchange charges fees. And so when you're scanning that QR code, it's going to put in the exact amount that CPT is requesting. However, it's not going to accommodate for the fee that the exchange is charging you to send that BTC out. So you have to manually go in and adjust that amount because of those fees from the exchange. Now, if you're paying from a mobile wallet, not an exchange, but a mobile wallet, I don't see that happening. It automatically just charge you the fees without you having to uh, add any more money. But if it's coming from an exchange, that's where I'm seeing that the most. So I want to make you aware of it so you can make your people, your new people aware of it as well, if they're going to be sending it from an exchange. Okay. Uh, also, in terms of the traders and their numbers showing up on their, on, their, uh, on their bio, on the website, we will get to the point where that happened. But some of the traders are new, which means we need a little bit more history to show. We don't want to show six trades, although I've done that on my Zoom meeting Sunday through Thursdays. Uh, I've been kind of transparent, just showing you what the numbers were for February, how many trades they had, what was their per 
average per trade. So I've been doing that every Sunday through Thursday on the Zooms. But we want to get to the point where it will be on the website. Just bear with us. Give us time. It will happen. Trust me, it will happen. As it relates to some of the other exchanges, we're working on it. We have a list of to do and a priority. It's, an, it's a priority list. And those exchanges are on the priority list, but there's some other things that are a little bit more pressing than those exchanges at the moment. So again, give us time. We will get to Gemini. We will get to maybe Coinbase Pro or some of the other exchanges. All right. So one of the things you have to think of, because I see people posting about different exchanges. First of all, the coins that we're trading, the exchanges, all of the exchanges have to have the same coins. So we can't just add any coin. Every exchange that we work with have to have the same coins for people to follow. OK, so just know if there's certain things that we're not doing, there's a reason that we're not doing it. We know this is not our first rodeo. OK, our guys, they've got 20 plus years experience in software. So this is not our first rodeo. They know what's going on. And so if there's something not being done, there's a reason it ain't being done. OK, we want this as user friendly as possible. I want to now get to the part where I introduce the traders. OK, because I want to give them their time so that you can hear from them. All right. So. We also added a new trader just yesterday. His name is Clarence. You'll see him on the website and all of that. I'm hoping he may have had a chance to get on here as well. All right. No, you cannot have two traders at one time. Cannot. Okay. You will jack up your system. Here's why. Different traders have different strategies. So one trader may say, okay, buy Ethereum. And then you got another trader say, get out of Ethereum. Different strategies. So no, you cannot. One at a time. OK, now, could we get to the point down the road where we create a program where we have a package if you want two accounts and we give you a little discount for having two accounts? Yeah, we could get to that. But just understand that some coding that takes place software wise, we have to also code in a different commission structure based on adding that second account. So those are things that we've talked about and that we have on the list, but it's not at the top. There are other pressing things at the moment that we want to get done. But trust me, it will get better and better and better, just like what I'm sharing with you. All right. So stay tuned for that. So now what I like to do, I want you to start hearing from these traders. I'm going to introduce them. There's been some questions that was asked and sent in to me. One of them we kind of talked about, how much should you trade? And that's basically uh, on, on the website now in the dashboard is letting you know how much you should trade. All right. Uh, not doing Forex. I can tell you that right now. At least no time soon. Not doing Forex no time soon. We're not trying to blow out anybody account right now. Okay. All right, guys. So. I guess the first trader, he just popped his camera off, so I got to get to him, man. This is a young, dynamic guy that's very, very gifted. He's very knowledgeable in the space of crypto and even more importantly, technology. And honestly, he is an expert in BTC pair trading. And he's one of the reasons that we are going to eventually add BTC pairs to our system, which, again, takes some coding, takes software and all of that. We'll get to that point. All right. But he is now plugging into what we're doing because he sees the vision of CPT and the way that this could really scale on a global level as opposed to in your own backyard, so to speak. OK, but this guy is documented and he's very well uh, knowledgeable in this space. I want you to hear from Copy Pro Trader Ramon, Ramon Wilson. Ramon, I'd like to welcome you, man. Thank you so much for giving us your time, because, guys, again, these traders do not have to do this. They were not required to do this when they come on as a pro trader with us. They volunteered to say, hey, yeah, I'll talk to the people. So thank you so much, Ramon, for giving us your time. If you don't mind, please just kind of share with us your background a little bit. And then uh, I think you have kind of those questions. I'll let you just kind of take it the way you want to take and we'll go from there. Yes, sir. Oh, so first of all, can you hear me, uh, Mr. McVay? We can. We can hear you perfect. Yes, sir. Oh, Mr. McVay. First of all, I just want to say, you know, I'm humble. You know, I really appreciate you because without, I mean, you, and I told you this when I first came on board, if it, you have like gave me the ultimate Christmas gift because 
I now have a platform where I can share in a community of people that may not be exposed to what you're trying to do, but I can now bring them into this space and show them that, look, this is safe, it's secure, and there is no pay to play. There is no pay to play with this at all. So Mr. McBay, I want to say thank you, sir. Thank you. Before I even get into my spill, thank you, sir, for real. You. I salute you. You know what I'm saying? Yes, sir. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, how y'all doing? You know, Ramon Wilson, AKA Mr. Wealthy by Nature, I trade crypto Academy CEO. Um, I'm just going to get straight into it. You know, I was in the army for 21 years. I retired in 2019. Uh, I got into cryptocurrency because in 2009, when Satoshi Nakamoto, him, her, a corporation, whoever it is, they wrote the white papers. We was actually using this technology to track the Taliban and Al Qaeda, meaning we was using biometrics, but they didn't want the information to be on a public server. They wanted to be somewhere where no one could get it or be hacked, meaning individuals that were out there, uh, you know, creating IEDs and uh, different bombs and things of that nature. So they came up with something called the blockchain. And it's kind of like what Satoshi did. So basically, every time someone came onto our fob, they had to scan their fingerprint, their eye, or some type of uh, physical uh, uh, stature that had to be tracked. And they had to keep it on a secure server. And in the Army, my job was I was a 25 Lima, which I was a cable system installer. So I installed the network. So I knew what was going on behind it. Long story short, three years later, I hear about something called Bitcoin. And I'm like, hold on. I looked at the white papers. I'm like, this is the same thing we was doing when I was building it. And when I found out how robust and how strong it could be in the future of it, I went all in. And so from 2013, so right now, I dedicated my whole life to this this space. You know, so as you can see behind me, I created a whole academy. We have a whole group of people like this is what we do. And when Mr. McBay, you know, and Coach D came to me about this, I was like, OK, this is what I do. I know how to trade. I come from the BTC side of the world. They on the UD USDT side, which is a great thing. I'm not I mean, actually, it's better than the BTC side, because here's the thing. When Bitcoin goes and dips, okay, most people want to panic. We call them in the, in the crypto space, we call them weak hands. They want to sell. No, what you do is you accumulate more. And what CPT has done is, okay, now you don't even have to worry about doing all that. You got professionals that are actually watching the charts. Like right now, I got one, two, three, four, five, six. I got seven screens that I'm looking at right now. And when Bitcoin makes a move like it just did with an all time high of 60,000, when it went to 48,000, I seen a lot of people selling. No, you don't sell an asset. You accumulate it and you compound on top of it. You know, compound interest is one of the, you know, seven ones of the world. And what I did was I said, OK, let me align myself with leaders that can put this information out there because I'm not I'm not a marketer. I'm a trader. That's what I do. So understanding that, you know, uh, cryptocurrency is something that really can change this world and it's really changing it. Because here's the thing. When a dollar goes to 97 percent inflation, when you go to the gas pump right now and you paying 280 down here in Florida, OK? You paying 280 for it. But with cryptocurrency, if Bitcoin goes to 48,000, you thought you lost the price of the actual coin. No, you still, if you had one Bitcoin right now and it's at 60,000, if it goes to 40,000, did you lose your one Bitcoin? No, you just lost the value of it. Yeah. You have to understand in cryptocurrency, you can break it down to the ninth decibel. Do you understand what I'm saying? So let me break this down. How much does it take to get a dollar? You got what? 10 dimes, 100 pennies. You can break it down to the each increment. It's only going to be 21 million Bitcoin made, ladies and gentlemen. Only 21. We had 19.85. So when the supply is gone, what do you think the demand is going to happen? Exactly. And if you have a piece of it, a Satoshi, which is the smallest increment of a Bitcoin, 
What do you think is going to happen? So y'all have to understand that. And that's why they in USDT because right now Bitcoin is moving right now. It's moving. So everybody's like, oh, the profits that's going on, the trades I'm putting in is for you to accumulate your profits. And then when it pulls back, that's what I'm going to tell y'all to do. Go ahead and move back to USDT. So now you got your profit. So when it pulled back, you got more to buy more of that asset and accumulate your portfolio. That is what an actual real trader is supposed to do. They're not supposed to buy when it's high. We buy when it's low. In the crypto space, Joe will tell you, he's going he gonna to get on here and tell you, when it's blood in the streets, we out here buying. We don't care what none of the news talking about. We laughing at them. <laughs> yeah, okay, we buying up everything. Because when they come back, it's going to come back heavy. And I, I got this quote from my, from, from my brother, Marcus, who's another trader in CPT. He said, look, bro, if you can't afford or if you can't respect Bitcoin 60% losses, you don't deserve its 680% gains. Point blank, period. You don't deserve it because you're not a true believer of what was going on because you got institutional money coming in. You know what I'm saying? You got Goldman Sachs. You got... Uh, 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 I mean, you got Walmart, you got Amazon. I mean, you got these big institutions that have money and there is the degree comes in. So they have put a whole bunch in and pull it out. You like, dang, hold on. It was uh, 60,000 on Monday. And then on Tuesday, it was 40,000. You understand what I'm saying? They can pull the rug, but you understand the technology behind it. Like we can do this. So in my, in my strategy, uh, Mr. McBay, what I want to go ahead and end this with, my strategy is, I base it off of mathematics, okay? It's called harmonics. So if you got a pen or something, look it up, harmonics and Fibonacci. So you might see my trading there for five, six days, and you like, man, this thing ain't hitting because most people don't understand and they they impatient. They think it's supposed to be instant. No, it's based off of math. So when you see my trades come in, please believe it's going to hit. It's going to hit it because it's based off of math. If resistance is touched, or broken or support is touched or broken it's got to come back to it i don't care if it's cryptocurrency stocks bonds futures whatever it is that's how the market moves it's always going to go back to the highest point and touch it or break it or it's going to go to the bottom touch it and come back up what goes up must come down and that's how i trade you know what i'm saying and my trades are based off of a small percentage you know what I'm saying? One and a half to two and a half percent. That's what I do. Because if you can do that every day, I'm talking if it hit, boom, 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 boom. And you're putting in USDT, this ain't going to a market that can fluctuate. You're going into a stable coin that's going to hold it. And that's what USDT is, is a stable coin. USDT tether is based off of the United States dollar. So if you got profits in Bitcoin or anything, and you scared that the market might go some way, put your profits in USDT. And when the market goes back, you buy more, catch it on the way up, do the same thing, put it back in USDT, wait for it to come back and buy in. That's what CPT is doing right now. And see, a lot of people don't understand that because they don't understand the, 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 the schematics of what we're doing and what Mr. McBay is just saying. We're not here to sell you anything and you have control over it. You don't have to pick me. You don't have to pick Doha. You don't have to pick Joe. But one thing you can remember is that we are putting you in position to grow your portfolio off of USDT. At any time, you can go in there and cash out. I don't have control of it. Matter of fact, I can't even see who follow me. Real talk. So that's all I wanted to say, Mr. Uh, McBay. You know what I'm saying? Man. Great, great. Thank you so much, sir, man. Awesome. Let me ask a few questions. Let me ask you a question. Okay. How much should a person set up their account with, fund it properly if they're going to trade with you? I know in the back office they got 15%. Like how many trades should they set their account up to be in minimum, would you say? Well, I, I'm going to say good, great question, Mr. McBang. So personally, I mean, there is no real no real answer to that, but right. you know, from, I, I what, understand. from 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 what I seen, you know, five hundred dollars, and you know, what I'm saying you take five percent increment, so you want it's twenty percent, so you're gonna take four trades, so five percent on any, you know, you got Ethereum, Litecoin, Link, 
and then you got Bitcoin Cash. You feel me? So okay. you want to put 5% on all of them. You feel what I'm saying? And if you're getting at least 2% on all of them, man, you're going to be at two grand in like a month and a half. You feel me? Yeah. Okay. So, so how many possible trade entries should they have at any one time? Uh, at least 10. At least 10. At least 10. Okay. Okay. At least I like 10. that. I like that. Okay. Um, have you any concerns regarding the cycles of Bitcoin and how it fluctuates the market in the bull markets come to when the bull market comes to an end and the market retractment uh, is based on previous cycles of 88 and 85 to 90 percent is kind of what they mentioned. Says. So what do you feel about the bull run? How do you how do you trade? What's your strategy in, in when we got a bull market right now? Yes, sir. Well, when it's a bull market, I'm definitely looking at that actual uh, support. I'm looking at that that actual drawback. So at 85, 95%, that's a good sign for anybody because if it does it, that means it's a lot of liquidity. You have to understand with Bitcoin, there is a lot of liquidity and a lot of money being pumped into it. So when it comes back, it, you're only going to win. Okay, so right now it's at 60 so if it pulls back to 40, you listen, you're not going to lose anything. It has to go back and test and it's going to break that. So if you bought it, if you bought it at 60 right now, OK, you in, you bought it at 60, it drops back to 40 and it goes to 80. You do the math. Still one. Yeah. yeah, exactly. So I'm not, I'm not I'm not worried about liquidity. I'm not. I mean, when it comes to Bitcoin, that is the king of king. I don't care what you got on coin market cap. People didn't understand this. You go to coin market cap right now everything on there can be liquid back to bitcoin ethereum you name it uniswap the DeFi project everything can be liquid it's only 21 million ladies and gentlemen it's only 21 million so a lot of people are got the hype going over here but it's only 21 million of the granddaddy of them all so when the market pulls back that's that's natural that's natural don't be afraid of just trust the process. That's the main thing everybody needs to understand. When, when I when I first started trading, I didn't understand that. My, my bro was like, bro, trust the process, man. Man, this thing losing. He's like, no, you're not losing. That is the market correction. It's called consolidation. It has to do that. You're going to have bulls and bears that come in here. You're going to have, you know, Goldman Sachs say something. You're going to listen. You're not losing with CPT. And that's why you see I don't have a stop loss. Because there's no need for one. Because I already know, I already know where the market's about to go. I already it's know. So, it's so funny. Doha is right here laughing at you because she she she's the same way as you. <laughs> yeah. I mean it's no it's no she's no just laughing. She was like, yeah. exactly. Doha. And she know, and I know I already know she know. I know Joe know when they get yeah. on. So yeah. so so Mr. So you Mr. McBega, you know what I'm saying? There's no need for a stop loss. You know what I'm saying? I don't care if it go lower. That means I'm going in Walmart and seeing them little yellow smiley faces that say rollback. That means I'm going in here. I'm about to go shop. I'm going shopping. I'm about to buy everything in here because I'm getting it for the low. And when it come out, we can already copy pro traders already got the stuff set. So that means I'm making profit. So if I got it, yeah. I'm just saying. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you so much, Ramon. Guys, you can see this is going to be great. This is this is real good right here. And guys, we, we got a new trader. I want to I want to ask this new trader to talk uh, before I get to some of the other other traders. And uh, he's new, very, very brand new. And so he's going to be able to share a little bit about his background and everything. Uh, Clarence, are you are, are you on? Let's see if he made it on Clarence. Yes, yes, I'm here. I'm here. There we go. Excellent. If you don't mind, just kind of you can introduce yourself and welcome to Copy Pro Traders. Uh, Clarence is our newest pro trader here at CPT. All right. Hello, everyone. Um, I'm blessed and honored to be a part of this community. Uh, I absolutely love the platform. Uh, Ramon, you the man. I love everything that you just said, so I'm not going to repeat any of it. Uh, I wholeheartedly believe in every, everything that you just said. Excellent. If you don't mind, you may want to just share with us a little bit about your strategy. Okay. Um, I'm more of an intraday trader. Um, I will open some positions and hold them, you know, if they take off. Um, but I like to get my money stacked, right? So I, I look at the market like a cash register or like a retail business person. 
Um, I want to check my cash register at the end of the day and um, see how much money I make. Right. So each day I'm looking to uh, open a position and close the position. And, uh, you know, God willing, it'll be in profit. Excellent. Excellent. There's some people messaging Clarence ask if you, I don't know if you're in position to or not, uh, to uh, turn your camera on if you, if you don't mind. If you're not, oh, yeah. not in position, don't worry about yeah. it. You got, okay. okay. <laughs> How you guys doing? Clarence is a bot, Clarence is a bot. Clarence is a bot. <laughs> he, yeah, he's a bot, huh? That's, I know. It's so interesting. People, they think that we have bots trading for us and not real people. And I'm like, man, people just don't get it. But those are people that have insecurity issues outside of CPT. They got insecurity issues in their relationships. They just insecure issues, period. So all we can do is tell the truth and we'll live on that. Mr. McBain, we here. Ain't no bots over here. You know what I'm saying? I know. <laughs> Ain't no bots over here. No bots. No bots. I, I know. So, so Clarence, so again, your your strategy, why, you, you, how, how long, how many trades you think you may take within a day? How long will they stay in those trades? And I know you, you can't, this is just kind of give some people some kind of idea. Yeah, yeah, for sure, for sure. So I'm, I like to do one trade at a time, right? Okay. Um, and so I'm not looking to be in the trade over 24 hours. And so if, if I'm, if I'm calling the trade or I'm taking the trade, I'm hoping to be in profit like in five, within five minutes. Right. And so um, I, I'm looking at very precise entries. And then once I hit a percentage profit, I'm, I'm good for the day. Right. And then I'm going to come back tomorrow and increase my leverage. And so um, that, that, that's my style. Um, you know, like I said, I will hold positions overnight. Like if we saw that big jump. Right. I'm obviously not going to close that out. Right. We'll, we'll, we'll go ahead and let that ride. Um, you know, we're looking at a nice, pattern formation now. I don't know if you guys are looking at your charts, but you know, we, we may be seeing a breakout. So, you know, I'm, I'm looking for very, very precise entries that I can get in and, and get out of and, and just stack the account. Got it. Got it. Okay. So, uh, again, we're, we're buying low. We're selling high at the end of the day. That's what we're doing here, guys. Just so you know, we're doing swing trades right now until we add more, which will come we will add more. We'll get there. All right. Thank you so very much, Clarence. Appreciate it. You're the newbie on the block, man. Thank you so much. Thanks for having uh, me. Absolutely. Let's go to Mr. Uh, Joe Marshall there in Texas. Mr. Joe Marshall, I've known for quite some time. And Joe is going to share his screen. He's going to go through some details. So, uh, Coach, we may want to make Joe a uh, – a, uh, I don't know if we have to make him co-host or host so he can share his screen. Uh, Joe's a technical guy as well, and he knows what he's talking about. He knows this business. I met Joe almost five years ago, and we were talking crypto. And uh, this was before I moved to Asia. Okay, am I? Can you hear me? Am I on? You're on. We can hear you, Joe. Okay, good deal. Well, first of all, right. Uh, I'm impressed that Antoine would admit he knows me out in the daylight, but I appreciate it. You know? But, uh, yeah, we go back away. And, and I've been here since day one, blessed in that. And then also uh, for the new people or, or the people that are just coming in, uh, this thing is rolling. It's, it's a work in progress. Uh, they have a roadmap out there uh, several months ahead. It's just going to be un unbelievable what they have going on uh soon to be and uh so proud to be on here and, and affiliated with these guys and, and also the traders too ramon you know i got those young guns out there uh coming in with the technology and the, and the background and yeah we need those guys and we appreciate you uh yeah and if coach d uh would if there's any way i could share my screen i was going to have everyone uh you should uh, be able to joe i made you co-host can you do it you don't see the screen? Okay. Share screen at the bottom. If not, I'll make you the host and do it. Okay, does that do it? Yep. Are you yeah. All right. Thank you. I'm going to turn up my volume because you're a little soft there. Okay. And right now, I need everyone to get out a pencil and paper because I'm going to show you some stuff that's going to take you. You know, you're going to know more than 90% of the retail uh, traders out there when I get through with you. Uh, just right quickly, this is obviously a weekly chart. Each candle is a week of price action uh, on Bitcoin here. And this is the 
about the longest chart I can find goes back 2011, 12, so on and so forth on Bitstamp. And as you can see, I keep my charts real, real clean. The only thing I use primarily is the 20 simple moving average and the 200 here. And uh, if you believe it or not, also uh, of March a year ago, okay, Bitcoin was at $3,700. Ethereum was at $88. Litecoin was at $24. Okay, that's a year ago. All right. Uh, Link, another one we're involved with, was at two dollars. Okay, so uh, there's plenty of, of running and gunning to, uh, to still to go here. And let me click this on. And this is the uh, part of this is Elliott Wave uh, from the very start. You know, we put in those five waves up uh, through 2017, that last bull market that we were in. And then uh, we did that three-way down. You don't need to know all this stuff. I don't use it day to day. I'm just showing you, you know, the potential here. This is my near-term target. This uh, FIB extension, uh, 61. Really needs to be about 62,000 is what we're uh, looking for. And we're way one. We're, and what Ramon was talking about, you know, the pullbacks, uh, corrections, however you want to say it. We still have a you know that wave two to come into at some point we're just you know waiting for that to happen and then we still have you know the three four and five to go so plenty of room to to push hey out joe, hey yes, joe once it once it complete once it complete that 50 percent, she out of there buddy yeah <laughs> come back she out of there buddy once she yeah. hit that two she out of there i'm telling you look you at it to... look left look left ain't nothing over there right 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 yeah, yeah she out of there buddy yeah <laughs> <laughs> exactly. And then what I was going to show you on the 2016-2017, uh, uh, that, you know, a lot of people don't think about. And that's why I just use these two. Well, I use other moving averages, but I don't clutter up my chart with them. I like it real clean. Uh, let's see if I can move this down here. So out of the way. Um, as you can see, as we've moved up, like if, like if someone came to me today and go, hey, you know, uh, Elon Musk needs you to, to go to Mars, you know, uh, you're not going to be on Earth you know, for, for a couple of years. Uh, I would, you know, uh, show my wife or, you know, uh, how to do this, when to get in, when to get out. And basically, once we close a weekly, a weekly candle up and over that 20, see how we held it? Now, we traded it back into the 20 several times here. But we didn't close until we started that bull market. So basically, that's what, you know, that's what I'd say. Hey, just hold everything until we start closing red, you know. And this is, I, I'm kind of being sarcastic. You know, this is real technical, real hard stuff. But, you know, that's, you know, uh, buy with big green candles coming off to 20 and, and sell if we start trading under it. And, you know, that's kind of the same way it is with day trading. Everything I show you uh, here forth, you can use on a two-minute chart. Uh, uh, you know, uh, weekly chart, whatever. And this is the latest chart here. We, uh, I was going to show you, this is the, you know, descending triangle. And I've, I'm showing you this because I'm going to show you something that just happened recently. And high percentage of the time they break to the downside, like they did back over here in 2018, we had the big dump. And, you know, more recently back in uh, 2000, you know, 20, uh, that March of last year. But let's go to the daily real quick and whenever a pattern whether it's a bull flag uh bear flag ace any triangle dc any triangle whatever if they this one was supposed to really technically break to the downside and when they break to the upside for whatever reason they run harder and stronger in the opposite direction that they're, they're technically supposed to to uh break to and then recently we just had this break and you know there's well no way to prove it but this was, you know, several days ago, uh, drew, well, a couple of weeks ago, drew this out. And then it's real simple. You just take this over here to this side and put it up over here where your, where your breakout is. And that's where your target is. And that's why I said earlier, if you remember, I said it's really 62,000 because that's what I'm looking at here on this uh, Bitcoin chart. Okay. So that's what I'm looking at for the next uh, target. And then... Not only that, where there's long-term uptrend line, resistance line, uh, going back to uh, July of 20, 
that tail to resistance. And that's going to be coming up here, uh, hitting us, you know, sooner or later. Uh, you know, so we could, you know, be into the 70s uh, before you know it, uh, you know, per, pretty readily. Okay. 73.5, Joe. 73.5. Okay. Gotcha. 73.5. Gotcha. All right. And then uh, another deal, uh, uh, Anton was talking about the, uh, uh, was talking about the, uh, you know, percentage of trades, number of trades. And uh, I'm all about ROI, return on investment. And uh, uh, that's why I like, you know, the smaller, you know, price coins, you know, your links. Uh, here and your Litecoins, uh, even Ethereum. But, you know, if you're, you know, just starting out and, uh, you know, don't have a lot to invest, uh, I mean, you guys can chime in and tell me, you know, right, wrong, and different. But it might be a good idea to also have a trading, you know, position open or at least, you know, have your API set up for, for example, Link, Litecoin, you know, those, uh, you know, smaller price coins to try to get the higher percentage, the higher, you know, pump in them. And also a little deal. Um, okay. Bitcoin's great, but, um, I think long-term, if you're a long-term investor, I think, you know, that, you know, like for example, Bitcoin cash, I think it'll overtake Bitcoin in market cap for the simple reason, uh, the amount of, uh, places, businesses, real world businesses that are taking Bitcoin cash and the transaction and the fees and, and how, you know, the, the speed of the transaction, uh, that also return on investment because the big institutions like right now, uh, yeah, every so often there's maybe a glitch on, on our platform, but 99.9% .9 of the time, it's one of the exchanges that has the glitch. Matter of fact, Coinbase, it's getting ready to IPO, meaning it's going to have an initial price offering. Okay. It is valued and, and Goldman Sachs is backing it up and are sponsoring it. And they're valuing it at $90 billion. Okay. It's going to be the first crypto, crypto exchange in the world to go public, to be able to people to, to trade on. So crypto is here. I mean, if that doesn't tell you, this is a real deal. And Wall Street, uh, that's another deal. Wall Street has blown up the housing market, blown up the stock market, and back in the day, blew up the tech market. Everything they touch, they blow up into a bubble, okay? Guess what the next thing they're putting their hands on to blow up? Yeah, crypto, okay? So even though we were at, you know, $3,000, $3,700 uh, a year ago, Bitcoin, uh, just imagine where we're going to be, you know, a few, you know, a few more years from now. And then, uh, you know, especially some of these altcoins, uh, we can get into that uh, later. But, uh, well, let me just show you this. This, uh, my, <laughs> this is my lifetime pick right here. Uh, all this sideways consolidation is boring. You know, you don't get a lot of, you know, price action out of it. But it goes sideways, breaks out, goes sideways. Man, this is the most healthy chart, you know, you could ever hope to see. And then you don't get these type... Uh, let's go back to link. And that's one of the ones we trade. Same deal. And then also you get huge pullbacks too. Okay. You know, the, the Lord giveth, the Lord taketh away, you know, there's 63, <laughs> you know, pullback there. Okay. Uh, but look where it went, you know, from when it broke out, just, you know, take it when it crossed over that 20 there to where it is today. Uh, you know, that's a thousand percent gain. And, and a lot of people are going to be coming over from the stock market. And that's what I was going to tell you about 90% of the retail investors is that Wall Street's coming. They're already here. They've been here. Uh, they were bad mouthing it, what, what they call FUD, fear, uncertainty, doubt, bringing it down, pushing it down, getting in, getting their positions because they didn't want, you know, retail having an advantage. Hey, hey, hey Joe, can I, can yeah. I interrupt you real quick? Just to, oh, uh, yeah. I want you, I want you to talk about something because and Mr. McBay, please forgive me, but I, I think well, that's, good. That's, on here, good. that's on here. You need to understand this. What Joe just said, that fear, uncertainty, and doubt, that is that is a tool that the whales use to help everybody out. So, for instance, okay, Mr. McBay, me and Joe, we all got $3 billion apiece. Okay, that's $9 billion. Okay, 
Mr. McBay, Joe, look, man, I like uh, I like booty coin. Or I mean, I, I don't know any coin. Hey, man, we're gonna pump it real quick. We're gonna pump it, and once it get to a certain point, we're gonna bring everybody in, and then we're gonna pull the rug on it from. Do people understand that's what's happening? That's why Elon Musk, the owner of Tesla, that's why he's on the investigation with Dogecoin because he has a major influence, a lot of money. They can pump a lot of money into the market real quick and get everybody rich because if 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 uh, if if Joe okay. and Mr. Uh, Anton got a hundred thousand dollars and a coin is less than a penny and they put all their money in there and I'm 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 the I'm the cake winner. I can put my money into it and it goes up and then I just go ahead and pull out. Guess what just happened? Right. Exactly. Y'all yeah. need to understand what's going on in this game. It's the same thing that go in the stock market and the derivatives market, because that's what it is. A derivatives market. You know what I'm saying? With a stock, you don't own nothing. When you buying Tesla and all these, you know, you see people buying stock. That's why I've never traded in the stock market. The reason why I like crypto, because I own my private keys on my exchange. Do you understand what I'm saying? So mm -hmm. no matter what happens, good or bad, I own my keys. So if the exchange goes down, I'm good. I still own that cryptocurrency because I own the private keys to it. And see, that's where the whole decentralized DeFi NFTs is coming in right now. And it's a lot of money because now banks are seeing like, okay, so when you come to me to get a car loan or a home loan, can't nobody erase that? I'm gonna dump my money into this now. That's what you that, that's what everybody needs to understand that's on the zoom right now. What he's showing you is that that's why the market is moving. Do you see that? It's moving way faster than the stock market. The stocks are about to be dead out of there because the companies are like, okay, I'm gonna cut the middleman out because I gotta pay the FEC, the SEC, and all these three letter alphabet boys this money when i can go ahead and take the same product goods or service and put it on the blockchain and sell to the same people i was selling to for almost 100 years for less than less than a penny that's where the game is going and you're now in the market with cpt where you can trade and even if you don't know about trading you got professionals that can do it for you that's the power we got right now ladies and gentlemen that's the power. And that's why Satoshi Nakamoto wrote the white papers. He said it's for the people, by the people. Decentralized. We don't need no banks no more. You can make a million, a hundred million dollars right now in crypto and the banks don't even have to know what, what you made it from. And they can't do nothing. How are you going to tax something that you don't recognize as an actual asset? Mm -hmm. That's hey. what I'm saying. I'm sorry. Thank you. Thank you. No, you good. That's good stuff. This is fire. This is what people needed to hear. Now, the, the people thought they want to learn or uh, uh, hear and talk from the traders, but this is the part right here why people say, oh, I don't want to trade. This 90% of the people that we're bringing into CPT don't want to do this. They are not going to read these charts and graphs. They don't want that. But we're showing you because we got real traders and this is what they live. They live and eat this stuff. This is what they do. I I see it every day <laughs> so you know i remember five years ago i didn't want to do it i'm like oh i'm not going to do that and it, when i thought i wanted to do it i was like oh no that's, that ain't what i thought it was i pulled away from it for a number of years before i came back so keep in mind these traders they love this stuff the way joe write these graphs and put these triangles this is his world this is his world <laughs> so Joe, real quick, because we got another trade to get to. Let me let's ask these questions. All right. How many possible trade entries, if someone is following you, would they might have? And what's what would you say maybe the time frame on those trades? Okay, I'm you know, I like the the long game, so to speak, you know, and yep. Ramon kind of talked about that, you know, holding and and we know where this is going, you know, seventy seven thousand. Uh, but uh, we like to get, get in and out as well. Uh, well, all of them, you know, every one, every, every coin that we have now, um, if it's, you know, if we're positive, I'm going to have a, uh, you know, a positive position. We're going to have a position in it, you know, uh, uh, with the stop loss because I like 
you know, keeping as much as I can once, you know, uh, before it's all, you know, like snow before it melts away. If we do, have to do it, <laughs> slam down or reversal. Um, but, but also I'd like people to, to know about the, you know, the other coins, cause you get more juice out of, you know, link like coin, you know, the, the smaller price coins, uh that's why you see over here you can see all these green numbers here you see you know eight percent up you know five percent uh nine percent so on and so forth and uh we're you know it's, it's as soon as we expand out we're going to be getting into uh you know uh, uh coins uh alt coins i call them you know that are yes you know have big potential to run and make those uh insane uh, return on investments, even and not. And the reason why I'm saying that is that uh, you know a lot of people don't have you know twenty, thirty, forty, fifty thousand, whatever to put into the market, and they're dealing you know uh, with a small you know uh, you know investment uh, sure you know bag. So we try to get the you know that would help them you know get more bang for the buck. And then also, uh, well, that's the first thing you know we're going to have you know decisions in every single coin. Number two, I would suggest that they set their API to, to be able to trade every single coin. And then the investment wise, I would uh, maybe put more, depending on the size of your investment, it's all money management anyway. Yeah. The size of your initial investment into the exchange, um, I would put maybe a higher percentage in Link and, and Litecoin. They're going to be strong runners. If you have a smaller bag and then depending on if, you know, if, if it's more money, then you could spread it out more evenly, you know, uh, and so on and so forth. I'm just trying to get people, uh, you know, to really return stuff, get return on that investment quick, fast, and, 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 and really an impressive return on it. Okay. Uh, so that's why I would, you know, uh, push in that direction. Mr. McBain, uh, I got a question with you and Joe. I mean, before you bring on the next trader, but yes, I, I think everybody need to understand what Joe just said, money management, because if you put a, you know, your whole bag into one coin, you have nothing for opportunity on the back end. You feel what I'm saying? <laughs> yes. So, so if you put all your money in, oh, Bitcoin, you know, you, you get into the FUD, you know what I'm saying? The, the whole, the whole FUD of Bitcoin, you forgetting about Ethereum, Litecoin, you know what I'm saying? And all these other tokens that you could be, you know, you could take a million dollars and you can break a million dollars down to what? Four quarters. You feel right. me? Right. So right. everybody needs to understand the before you even get into trading and y'all don't have to worry about this because the pro traders have already figured this out. But what I'm saying, if you want to merge outside of that, because here at CPT, not only can you follow us, you can do your own trading. But you need to money manage. Okay, if I got a million dollars, I'm not going to put a million dollars in the Bitcoin. I'm going to put maybe a hundred and twenty thousand in the Bitcoin. I'm going to put a hundred and twenty thousand. Oh, you see what I'm saying? You got to break it out because it's bigger than just Bitcoin. It's way bigger. It's yes. with the technology right now. I mean, you got NFTs. You got people selling stuff like, I mean, they could sell this right now as an NFT. Right now, and they're selling for two hundred, three hundred thousand dollars in Ethereum or WEF, what's called Rap Ethereum. Same thing. So you need to understand that the market is is changing, ladies and gentlemen. Money management is the number one rule to any trading. Before you even look at any charts, your money management. How much I'm gonna spend on this and that? Because if you don't have the money to spend on a trade or to you know catch a trend. What are you going to do? You're going to be sitting there on the sideline like, man, I missed that because I put all my money over here. That's all I got to say, Mr. McVay. That's all I got. I'm just saying. Money management, yes. ladies and gentlemen, please. And, and what you mean by that, guys, all you have to do is fund the account properly and set your per trade amount properly where you can be in quite a few trades, 10 to maybe 12 trades at any given time if the market says so. If the market says so. They're not just coming in and saying, oh, I'm going to do 12 trades today. No, they're looking at the market. The market is going to determine what they do. OK, the other thing is trust the process. Trust the process. I see somebody message that just trust it. You paid your money. 
Trust the process. You know, um, the next trader that we're going to bring up, and thank you so very much, Joe. Thank you very much, Ramon. Thank you very much, Clarence. Uh, Doha, um, there was a trade. There were six trades, I believe it was six, that was pending and been pending since February 21st. <laughs> and uh, I think now three of them have closed and there's three still left. <laughs> But those are like on the shelf. And if you got your account properly funded where you can, in which, you know, we thought maybe six was okay. We, we talk about being your minimums, but you should never make your minimums your maximum. Now you can just, you know, if you got more USDT, you want to be able to get in all those trades while they sit on the shelf. So one of them just closed today, 21 days. But you'd be surprised how many people don't have the patience to wait 21 days to make a profit. It's just mind blowing to me. This is a marathon, as Coach D said in the very, very beginning. We're not here to sprint. If you're looking to do this and try this for $99 just one month, and I'm gonna tell you, save your $99. Don't do it. Don't do it. You gotta commit. You gotta be in it. And that's the only way you're going to see the fruit of this thing that it's going to work out. So I've got a uh, pro trader Doha here, and I'm going to help with translation, guys, because obviously she's Vietnamese here in Vietnam. So I'm going to help with translation. Uh, I know her language. I know what she's saying. And uh, that way she can kind of talk to you about her strategy and what she's doing and, you know, go from there. Pro trader Doha. <laughs> Hello, everybody. <laughs> yes, I can see you guys. Uh, so happy to be here and see all of you uh, look, you guys, very happy. And uh, I'm sorry. Uh, thank you. Uh, who is that? Uh, Ra Raman? Ra Raman Trader? Uh, Ramon. And Ramon. Joe, just share the yeah, chat. Ramon. Yes, Ramon is the tra mm. trader here. Uh, Clarence is another Clarence, trader. Yes. And Joe. And Joe, yes. Thank you very much, uh, Trader, my friends. <laughs> uh, and thanks, Joe, because you just uh, shared the uh, chats for the people. I, I trust in here have many people, they never trade. And they even don't know much about the cryptocurrency. So that the knowledge showed them is very good. But on the trader like us, we have a knowledge. We have also experience. Because in that industry, some knowledge is uh, not decide to make you uh, become the winner. You need to uh, experience because experience is to make you your feeling, no panic. Like uh, Ryman says, this market is up and high. We say pump and dump. Right now, as a BTC is a 60, we know it's gonna hit 60. We know the time, even we don't know exactly what day, but we know when. Okay, so what we think and what we see, and we told the people two weeks ago, it's happened now. Okay, but the BTC may be dumb anytime. Okay, and because the money all the way on the exchange, okay? And and sometimes the market bump and dump because well, and the people have a weak hand, we lose. If you don't panic, you all the way win. That means, like the my trade uh, from last, last month, yeah. the people uh, asked me about, oh, when I see my account as a new money, Okay, uh, I said everything that it's just show the coin there, you don't lose. You only lose when you click to sell to USDT. Okay, my link's still there, my Ethereum's still there. I don't lose. I, I, you know, that's why I all the way uh, tell Antoine, I need the people understand the strategy, my strategy. Okay, you need have a money to, and that money you need to separate to six at least, yeah, at least six 
to 10, even 12 account. My account sometimes is a 18. I sometimes make a 20, 20 24 trade. And, and I even stock in the market. You know how much? 80% that means is a 20 trade. And I have a only 4,000 left to continue to trade to communicate when the market down. Okay, so everybody do the same way. And when I send a signal, why I, I say, oh, you need at least six to 10 or 12 is a good because I send a signal from the three to four trade a day. Okay, and then I will get out this because my average, average, yeah, average. okay, it's um, maybe different other trader, different Roman, uh, different Joe or other trader. I because I'm I'm lady I'm woman I need to fix <laughs> financial <laughs> at least for the daily spending right <laughs> so that's that mean yes that mean I need uh I need this money daily to pay for the bill daily okay other people need the same way okay I'm very detailed I'm, I am the detailed woman that's that mean I I do that strategy uh, okay. Maybe you don't have a huge win yet, but you have income daily, daily, daily. Okay, and and I'm very carefully with the 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 the, the markets. That's why I need you have a more account. If some account is not reached the uh, percent I want, I say okay, hold, wait, wait. Okay. Okay. When she say account, she's talking about more funds in your tether. To be able to be in on trade, so that's what more she's trade, doing. more trade, more trade. So okay. Make sure you're in position to be okay. able to take more trades <laughs> if the market says so. Yeah, more trade. So, uh, so like uh, today, have a, some people have a trade from last month. Yeah. You got on today, totally. How much, Antoine? Uh, there was three trade, no, four trades that closed today, cumulative ten point five three percent. Yeah, ten point five. Okay, and I have a ten point five like you guys too. You know, so so that means we stay there. The money lose or not? No, it didn't lose. It even more gain most now, right? You can see your <laughs> account now. So all the traders same. We don't panic, and you you guys trust us. Just keep doing that. And in trade, you have to take time. You cannot see daily, today, tomorrow. And I, I would have a something chain uh, in my strategy now too, based on the what's going on in, in the market, okay? Some trade, I send the signal. Some trade, I will close in the 24 hours, maybe earlier, maybe longer, okay? But some trade, I will take longer. But I will buy deep. I have a benefit when the market's moving up. But I will not get out because I have a knowledge to make to know it will move more, and then some trade will have a more percent. I, and you, you, you know, sometimes I send out the signal to buy Bitcoin, but I focus about the other coin because the benefits more than Bitcoin. Okay, with the money we have, we trade other coin and link, right? Oh, like Ethereum, if, uh, Ethereum now is very nice, right? But we not buy when the market moving up. Now, very risky, right, Roman? Very risky. Even you see, oh, hi, hi, no, don't grab it. Because a percent just this, and then very risky. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Uh, my, my words is right? It's right, it's right. Yeah. Okay. Hey, 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 Doha, I... I I'm, I'm, I'm about to take your quote and I'm putting on the t-shirt. Doha said, I buy deep. I like to buy when it's at the low. I mean, I want it to be in the, in the, in the dirt, in the mud. That's <laughs> what I'm going in. That's what I'm going in. Doha said, I buy deep. You buy deep. You know what I'm saying? Because you, you have, you have a so much potential. If you buy high, you don't have, you don't know where it's going. And yeah. you, you, 
Man, Doha, man, okay, Doha. I, I just want to say that. Hey, hey, I, I just want to say that. Doha said, I buy deep. I'm, I'm, I'm taking that. I'm taking that. I buy deep. And also, if you buy deep, you can go deeper. You can't be pitching knives. You know, the pro traders. Right. Hey, Joe, listen, listen. With CPT, see, people don't understand that, man. What Doha just said, she said, listen, understand the management of your account, but we're going to buy deep. So when we come in and you looking like, oh, and you – because here's the thing. We are programmed as humans to go with the hype. If anything is on the internet and on TV and they say, oh, Bitcoin is at 60,000, we looking like, man, I'm mad as hell right now. Because now we know it's topped out. Our profits ain't no more. We got to wait for it to be like, oh, Bitcoin then tanked. That's when all the traders be like, yes, sir. Like, we ding, 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 ding. Yeah. Yeah. like yes, sir. <laughs> <laughs> we see, you know, Bitcoin and tanked, and it went to forty thousand. We all go high. Everybody, everybody's scrambling. Like, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. No, I ain't taking no calls from Coach. I ain't taking no calls from Anton. Doha, no, I don't want to talk to nobody. I'm in here. <laughs> That's when we like it because we like to buy deep. Because at the end of the day, your profits is going to be even more. And here's the thing: it's not cash. We're dealing with a decentralized, an actual cryptocurrency that has a market cap meaning there's only 21 million ladies and gentlemen so it doesn't matter if it's ethereum it doesn't matter if it's bitcoin cash link with all of it can be linked back to what the grandfather so that's what everybody on here needs to understand man like when we see and people panic you know what I'm saying this ain't the stock market where you got you know you didn't got your house up for you know up for sale because of a no, listen. When Bitcoin goes to forty-eight thousand, watch how Doha act a fool. I already know how she gonna do. Watch how Joe act a fool. I already know how they gonna do because we all have the same mindset. We we not worrying about a six oh six thousand. That's cool. Okay, it broke that. We know it's gonna break it. It's only a certain amount that's gonna be minted ever, ever. So we not worrying about all the other stuff that's out there. We're worrying about how we can keep our product and our service and our customers and make them a profit. And so we catching everything that's going low. And when it dip, like like Doha said, we going deep. When it goes deep, <laughs> when, when, like Doha said, when it go deep, we going to get it. We we going in. We going all in. So matter of fact, matter of matter fact, some of these traders already have their deep price set. Right. For you customers. I, I, Already. Exactly. So if the market automatically dips and hits, and automatically it's boom, it buys it's, and puts everybody in the market. And listen, right, and, and, right. oh Lord, Mr. Oh, Mr. McMahon. Like <laughs> so, and, so, and, and, and that's the thing, because you got a market and you got a limit. A limit means okay, when it come back down to here, I'm getting in. So again, like I said, I'm gonna give you an analogy. You walk into Walmart, you got a hundred dollars. You're like, man, I'm trying to go ahead and get me, you know. I'm trying to get me, you know, this, that, and the other. When you walk in there and you start seeing them yellow smiley faces, talking about rollbacks, you like, oh yes, sir. I'm about to act, I'm about to act a fool because you're getting everything at wholesale, but you actually, you know what I'm saying, could resell it at retail. And that's what crypto is. When 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 Bitcoin drops back to 40,000, because it's gonna be a correction, you know what I'm saying? It, it, it's about to run to 70,000. It's about to go to 70,000. I mean, the, the numbers add up, but when they go to 70,000, watch when they pull back about 85, 90%. Everybody going to be talking crazy. Bitcoin is ain't nothing. It's a, it's, it's a scam. And watch what happens. Because once it hits that, once it hits that 70, she gone. She going to be gone. Because that means that at least another million, two million have been already uh, mined. And remember, we had 19 and a half right now, almost 19 and a half. Market cap is over 1.8 trillion BTC market cap dominance right now. So when it hits 21 million, if there's no more Bitcoin that can be mined, that means everybody that's mining Bitcoin right now can't mine it no more. And if you own a piece of Bitcoin, so if one Bitcoin is worth $100,000, you got 0. 0.000008. How much do you think that Bitcoin can be worth? That's all I'm going to say. I'm gone. Okay, we're going to hurry up and let uh, Doha wrap this thing up before I close it out. You you, you can pay. Are you done? You got a little bit more? <laughs> <laughs> I 
<laughs> so have a man, so have some people they come back to ask me oh you you said you you are you you buy deep and you sell high so why some choice stuck there it's very normal okay that's why i need you guys have a server trade not only one not only two not only three very it's not enough for this market, okay? Because when we buy that, we see the BTC will go up. But it turned, turned. Yeah. When I just send out the signal, I, I, I see I will close that old signal in the four or five hours, okay? But the market tank is very normal happen. It's not happened one time. It will gonna be happen again, okay? But now you see 60 now, over 60, thousand for BTC now okay so that means we our notice we see the BTC up is it happen and the people panic they said no I need to say okay you guys can go to your exchange and sell by yourself I cannot do that because I have many people follow me if I click to sell the people want to hold that they will lose money so I told Antoine okay let the people who want to sell and accept the laws, okay, let them do that by themselves. Because our system, that's amazing. That's why I agree to become the trader here. Because the people can do by themselves on their exchange. Control their own money. But they can control their money. They don't have to follow us, okay? You guys can follow us, get a signal, but you guys can immediately go to the exchange after when you receive the email to set the limit to sell okay you decide you can sell anytime you want you don't have to follow us okay that the thing i really i really happy for that and and then you see the the results after two months of all the trader okay you you know that you know how to um Calculate, uh, calcul calcul calculate, calculate the the money. In this industry, we cannot give you exactly the number, but you can see. Okay, uh, Raman have uh, this strategy, Doha have uh, this strategy, Joe have uh, this. Okay, you you get decide, and then you calculate the money you have uh, to join in, and how much for one choice. Okay, but remember. At least you have a two from six to 10 or 12 choice, okay? To cover the money you want, how much you earn. You see the, 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 the income in two months of the traders here, and then you pick up the trader and you, you, you do calculates by yourself. With me, sometimes I grab with a high percent, but this take time the mean holder okay but sometimes uh, sometimes i try not try but my target is a choice daily for you guys have income daily okay so that is a my strategy so some try if take longer just patient don't panic excellent okay guys well you've heard from four traders uh, there's a, a couple more, but uh, obviously uh, we'll do these again, I'm sure, and we'll have more traders. Our goal is to have about 20 traders as we continue to grow the company. Again, my suggestion, guys, is to trust the process. We've recorded this. You'll be able to listen back at it again, get it out to your team, but uh, I'm going to be honest with you. The biggest wall that you've got to climb is the one that you put in your own mind. <laughs> the biggest wall you got to climb is the one you put in your own mind. <laughs> so, guys, with that being said, guys, hey, let's take Copy Pro Traders to the next level because guess what? As you grow your business, you are a direct reflection of how many children we help feed. We are purpose driven, mission led. <laughs> so guys it's been a plum pleasing pleasure as well as a privilege and I look so forward to more to come with CPT guys if you don't talk to your people listen to me if you don't talk to your people somebody else is going to talk to them for you I, I can assure you that it's already happening so all around the world 
I'll yeah. show you because I you want to say uh, good night to everyone. Say to say thank you very much. For <laughs> thank you very much. Uh, I see. I'm special here because only me is a woman. Is a trainer, trainer right now. Yeah, huh? only trainer right now. <laughs> Doha, I love you. I love you, Doha. <laughs> I love you guys too. So no, no, we no, go. So <laughs> <laughs> we had the pleasure on the Zoom call. Thank you so much. It was amazing to see you again. Thank Mate. you. Very happy to see you guys here. Yeah. yeah, very happy. And we will go to the more success. Okay. <laughs> Good night, everybody. Good night. Bye -bye. Thank you so much. Awesome work. You're welcome. Coach.